my two minute conviction this week is let's pursue courage over confidence in a world of appalling superficiality really uh, we see people uh, live out enormous amounts of confidence but we can never know what's really going on in the inner world of individuals and confidence is, an, is, is, is one's belief in their own capabilities it's, it's almost wanting an assurance of an outcome but you know how often do we in the workplace and in all other spheres of life have certainties over what it is we're applying ourselves to and so confidence is nowhere near as important to me than courage courage the boldness to take risks the willingness without assurances to apply yourself with good endeavor to opportunities and even when you are lacking internal confidence it's the courage that causes you to step out, to step up, and to have a go. And so I, I really want to um, urge all of you as emerging and established leaders to be much more people of courage than you are necessarily worried about your inner confidence. We want people with character over charisma, with substance over style, and, and again, with courage more than confidence. So whether it's initiating a difficult conversation with a work colleague where you have to confront some behavior Behaviors, whether it's volunteering to lead the next project, whether it's owning your own business, whether it's standing up and advocating for a cause that is important to you, but may be unpopular to those around you. It's not about your confidence. It's not about your assurance of what will happen next. It's about your courage to do what's right regardless. And so that, that's my two minute conviction team this week. Let's practice courage more than be worried about our inner confidence.